For the CH2Br2 Lewis structure, carbon has four valence electrons, hydrogen has one, but we have two hydrogens, bromine seven, but we have two bromines. Add it all up, we have 20 valence electrons for the CH2Br2 Lewis structure. Hydrogens always go on the outside of Lewis structures, and then when we look at the carbon, carbon's less electronegative than bromine, so we'll put the carbon in the center, and we'll put a hydrogen on either side, and then we'll put the bromines on top and here on the bottom. We have 20 valence electrons for the CH2Br2 Lewis structure. We'll put two between atoms to form chemical bonds, and we've used eight valence electrons. Then we'll go around the bromines to complete their octets. So we have 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, and 20 valence electrons. So at this point, we've used all 20 valence electrons. The hydrogens each have two valence electrons, so their outer shells are full. The bromines, they have eight, so they have octets. And then finally, the carbon in the center of the CH2Br2 Lewis structure, it has eight valence electrons as well, so its outer shell is full. So we've used all the valence electrons, completed the outer shells for each of the atoms. That's the CH2Br2 Lewis structure, and this is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.